OK, uh, here we go. Here I have a problem. x plus 3 divided by 4 equals 12. And this one's a little bit tricky because when you think about your years of operations, um, you, know, you want to undo addition and subtraction first. So the common thing is say, oh, I'm adding a 3 to my variable, so I need to subtract. But we have to be careful with that 3 because that's actually not a 3. Ooh. It is a 3, but it's a 3 that's being divided by 4. So the value of that 3 right there is actually just not 3. It's actually 3 divided by 4. So we got to be careful. And so you'd say, oh, OK, well, if it's 3 divided by 4, then I'd subtract 3 fourths. And you're right. Let me show you how we can rewrite this. Look at x is being divided by 4 as well as 3 is being divided by 4. So I can rewrite this as x divided by 4 plus 3 divided by 4 equals 12. So by breaking it up, now I can use my inverse operations, subtract 3 fourths on both sides, multiply by 4, and I get my variable by itself. However, there is a trick um, to doing this. Not really a trick, but kind of when I was talking about um, adding and subtracting those, uh, or I'm saying when we had those fraction problems for two-step equations, I didn't. I said, hey, if you want to use your inverse operations, that's fine. But I don't like using, I don't like doing operations with fractions because you're just more inept to make mistakes. So what I prefer to do is get rid of the fractions. So even on this problem, you can get rid of the fractions. And what would you do? To get rid of the fractions, you'd have to multiply by 4, right? Well, that's the exact same thing that you can do up here. Because look at, I'm taking these two terms, and they're being divided by 4. So to undo divided by 4, I'm going to multiply by 4. All right? So now you multiply by 4. 4 divided by 4 equals 1, right? So I'm just going to be left with x plus 3 equals 12 divided by 4, which is 48. So now I just have a one-step equation. You're like, yeah, I got a one-step equation. I can solve this. Subtract 4 on both sides. x equals 44. Done.